Namaste children. This is Mausmi here, your maths teacher. I hope you all are well. And I think you all have finished your previous assignment. Okay. So previous lesson we have learned about shapes like bigger, smaller, biggest, smallest, further, nearer, or top, bottom, etc. So today we are going to learn about shapes there are so many shapes here you can see the picture so first one is triangle then this is circle rectangle cube cylinder cone other than this there are other so many uh, shapes are there okay now let's see in your textbook so here so many objects have given you have to match with the similar shapes okay so first one the battery is matching with a cylindrical shape so we have to match whatever cylindrical shape object are there with the cylinder let's do see this bottle is look like cylinder this pencil is look like then candle then this box then this paper wrap now anything is left out no okay now we will go to the this cube or box so this one or this bricks or this box okay now let's see which one is look like cone The cone is look like this ice cream cone then this birthday cap then this simple cone anything else no now this ball or spherical shape or circular shape this one then this is orange then ball then balloon then watermelon okay already we have matched okay next let's see Yes, here what a make pair of the similar shapes. We have to make pair. Mm -hmm. Then this cone is like this. Then this one is like battery. This bottle is, is like candle this box is like this one then this box bricks then this balloon is like watermelon ball yes anything left no yes now the next is rolling and sliding so rolling and sliding we will see that which things can roll and which thing can slide but before that you all enjoy this game no when you are in park i know you all are missing this because you can't go outside okay let's see see i have made a slide here so with the exam pad okay now we will see which things can slide which things can roll down i have a color pencil so this color pencil if i keep like this way this means lengthwise it will slide if i keep in the round surface it will roll down you observe so this pencil it can slide also or it can roll also see it can if i keep down surface it will roll down now I have a kiwi fruit. All the sides are round. Correct? Now see what will happen. So it is rolled down. Okay? Now I have a box. Yes, all the sides are flat. Slides. Okay? So, as all the slides are flat, however I will keep, it will slide, it will not roll down. Now, I have a small bottle. 
it has round surface also it has flat surface also see if I give the flat surface it will slide okay now if I keep the round surface it will roll down okay now I have a ruler so if I ruler all the sides are flat so it will slides now I have a coin so it has flat surface and round surface so if I give the flat surface it will slide then round surface it will roll okay so now you observe which things can roll or which things can slide the things which have round surface can roll that surface it will slide so here I have shown that ruler and box all the surface are flat that's why they slides only kiwi fruits or kiwi fruits all the sides are round that's why it ro uh, roll but pencil bottle and coin they both have they all have both flat surface as well as round surface that's why they can easily uh, slides also and roll also okay now let's see your text here you can observe they have asked you take the object which can roll so you can see which one it will roll first one I'm saying you pencil ball and onion can be roll second one you have to do only here you have to take the object which can slide this is a nice story so the story is like that wise grandmother so one lamp one to me to his grandmother it is going in between through a jungle and he met a wolf and wolf want to eat that lamp but lamp was clever he told I want to meet my grandmother let me meet then I will when I will going back you can eat me so when he reached to his grandmother he uh, told everything to his grandmother and grandmother was very clever so what she did she did take a dollop and put the lamp inside that and the path of the uh, grandmother house to that lamp house it was a sliding path so grandmother rolled down the dollop and this um, greedy wolf was asking did you see the lamp coming then from the dolok that sound come no no I didn't see and then that uh, dolok was rolling down and the wolf was running behind that and wool, the lamp easily reached to the home and unlike this way they use the path sliding path and this round object to roll down okay now you have this related to shapes so many activities so these all activities so match the shape same size so which one is same you have to match okay this you should do see the size and match so match the same shapes so here different different shapes you have to match each the shapes with one another then color the smallest one you have to find out already we have compare smallest biggest already we have learned like that way you have to complete now here you can see see with the use all the shapes they can make so many similar face so you have to join the similar type of face okay see here they use triangle and then rectangle and make here they use circle here they use cylinder so like that way you also can do that okay so like that way you have to complete till page number 20 you have to color and match okay now with that I have given some assignment to write in our classwork okay so make like this table 
like circle, cylinder, rectangle, cone. So five five things name you have to write what you can see in your home or around you. Like circle you can write ball, then uh, food plate. Okay, like that. A cylinder you can write your water bottle. Okay, your pencil. Rectangle you can write that mobile phone, TV. Like that way you have to neatly write okay then you have to draw any one animals with the help of different shapes and you have to color it okay that idea you will get from your textbook i hope you all have understand and if you have any doubt ask to me in this group okay i am there always with you and no need to post this assignment in the group okay neatly you should learn and keep with you Okay, thank you children.